Welcome back to Ice Cream Meltdown. I've got Ben and Jerry's Netflix and Chilled here. I actually drove around quite a bit last night looking for the new Colin Kaepernick flavor. Um, I went to Target, Walmart, Harmons, and I couldn't find it anywhere. And then I'm seeing a few people on YouTube that are getting it shipped to them. It's arriving on their doorstep. So I think the problem is I don't have enough subscribers. So if you could just click the little subscribe button down there, give me a thumbs up if you like these videos, leave a comment or two, then maybe I'll get Ben and Jerry's and other companies to start sending me products in the mail, which would be awesome. And I'll provide great reviews for you. Um, so I'm going to try this one. It's not brand new, but it's another Netflix one. I did the punchline the other day, which was kind of cool. Um, this one here, it's got peanut butter ice cream with sweet and salty pretzel swirls and fudge brownies. That sounds pretty tasty to me. And I actually haven't eaten since breakfast this morning, so I'm totally hungry. I'm not going to eat a lot of this because I'm going to get some dinner after. But I actually love eating ice cream when I'm hungry because I don't know, it just tastes even better. So let's, t let's get a first look here. It's kind of frosty. Pull off the Netflix cap. And that's what, that's what it looks like. It looks like a peanut butter color, just kind of an off-white with some little specks in there. Looks pretty tasty. I'll get my nice little scooper. And by the way, I ordered a heated scooper on Amazon. So that's coming in the mail soon, and I'm pretty excited to try that. This one works decent, but the heated one was just kind of a novel thing I wanted to try. So I scoop in here. You'll see there's a big chunk of fudge brownie in there, which looks really good. I can smell it. I haven't even tasted it yet, but it just smells like peanut butter. It's like almost like a peanut butter cup, like a Reese's or something. So I'll take a bite. Mm. Yeah. It's like I would expect. It tastes like chocolate and peanut butter. These little brownie chunks are kind of like soft brownie in here. Let me see if I can get a bite with a brownie chunk in that. There we go. Mm. Oh yeah, that's good. It's extra good with the brownie pits and bits in there. Mm. Oh yeah, this is good stuff. It's super creamy classic uh, Ben and Jerry's. It's not it's not the dairy-free kind. Um, I'll give you a couple nutrition facts if you like. Um, 24 grams of fat per serving. That's quite a bit. I think that's actually more than some of the other Ben and Jerry's. Probably the peanut butter has a lot of fat in there. Um, if you were to eat this whole container you'd be getting 72 grams of fat or 29 grams of saturated fat, which is 145% your recommended daily dose. So you'd be eating more than a day's worth of saturated fat, which sounds kind of insane. So if you do eat a whole pint of this, which I'm not planning to do right now, you should probably go run a marathon or something to burn it off. But just having a couple scoops, you're going to be happy with it. It's really good. Mm. Love it. No, this is a repeat. I haven't bought it before because my wife's gluten-free, so it's got these little pretzel bits. I can't even see the pretzel. There's actually a couple tiny little bits of pretzel in there. I think it just adds to maybe a little bit of saltiness and a little crunch. Um, but really, it just tastes like peanut butter ice cream with the smooth brownies in there. Um, so this one's going to get devoured by my family for sure. It's super good. Um, that's it. I'd give this thing probably like a 9 out of 10. I'm definitely going to buy this one again. It's Ben and Jerry's Netflix and Chilled. So thanks for joining. This is Mark. This is Ice Cream Meltdown. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Leave a comment. Tell me what else you'd like me to talk about and review on the channel. And I uh, hope to see you next time.